NASA is set to make a big announcement about the first ever mission to touch the sun. The space agency will announce the launch of a solar probe that will fly directly into our sun's atmosphere. NASA will announce its Solar Probe Plus mission on Wednesday, May 31st. The probe is expected to face heat and radiation unlike any other spacecraft ever before since it will be orbiting within 4 million miles of the sun's surface. The spacecraft will explore the sun's outer atmosphere and make critical observations that will answer decades old questions about the physics of how our star works. The resulting data will improve forecasts for major space weather events that impact life on Earth, as well as satellites and astronauts in space, NASA said in a statement. With the Solar Probe Plus mission, NASA is looking to break its own record of inching ever closer to the sun. Now in 1976, Helios-2, the second spacecraft to be launched by the space agency to study the sun, flew as close as 43 million kilometers to the surface of the sun. In contrast, NASA's new mission will get much closer to the sun. Now for reasons currently unknown, the corona is hundreds of times hotter than the surface of the sun with temperatures at 500,000 degrees Celsius or higher. It's also behind the solar wind, a constant stream of charged particles that can impact life here on Earth. NASA's new mission is slated to launch in the summer of 2018. The probe will fly past Venus seven times over the course of almost seven years as it gradually settles into its orbit around the sun. Although the spacecraft will be protected with a 4.5 inch thick carbon composite shield, it will face temperatures as high as nearly 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit. That's hot. What do you think? Is NASA sending this probe to the sun to simply do some science work and study it to help benefit Earth? Or is there some sort of secret mission going on to the sun to study possible portals that some say open up on the sun at certain times? Leave your comments below this video. Thanks for watching.